Well, here I am arriving at the Mariana Kistler Beach Museum of Art, which has mounted an exhibition of my prints and drawings and one painting. I'm walking through the second floor of the beach. Here are the rooms where my work is hung. You can see some large pen and ink drawings in this first room. Rick and Annette. And they have some catalogs out. They published a nice catalog in color of the show, although you can't see color in the video very well because the light is so dim. Bill North, the curator of the Beach Museum, has written an essay about my work and process, and his wife, Corey Sherman North, wrote about the Japanese prints, which inspired some of these big head prints and the blue color of my woodcuts. Lion is not seduced by the bells, whistles, and whiz-bangness of digital technology. Computers and machines are among the many tools in his kit. They are assistants to whom he delegates technical tasks. In doing so, the artist seeks to realize his conceptions by moving directly from his mind to the finished object, or as he is fond of putting it, Look, Ma, no hands! Cute, Bill. Uh... nice bunch of Okubie big head prints, mostly Osaka from the Kyoto area mid-19th century. Beautiful Haranobu print, pillar print. A Hiroshige landscape. Beautiful Shinsui eyebrow pencil with a bright red background. The lights are so dim and yellow in here, the camera can't pick up the brilliant orange background of that print. Almost like being underwater in here. The reds just don't show up. The Tamaro triptych. I love that print. And the Suikoden. Heroes of the marsh or outlaws of the marsh. Another beautiful print. Two walls of Japanese prints, uh, the Anthony woodcut, a Jim painting, a Jim lithograph, and uh, three more woodcuts, including the gigantic Sarah from 17 blocks. The color in all those prints is brilliant blue. Sorry it doesn't show here, but you can find examples elsewhere online. Crosby, another Anthony drawing, Rick and Annette, Linda, 